on the line. Sue Bird opens off back iron. Tight rope in that baseline, and Mitchell open for three off back iron. Kayla George. And Kayla George running the floor. And I was... the, the wheels fell off a little bit for them, but I, I think the Americans are very confident to get off cleanly. Sue Bird feeding Brianna Stewart. And she rattles it home. Cyclones to Brianna Stewart with a shot clock at seven. And Brianna Stewart, too. Not like U.S. men playing Spain, where really a team's death. Tarazi, cycle to Brianna Stewart, hottest player going. She drops it. About them in the warm up that I noticed was different than the pool play games. I thought they'd be locked in. I thought. Griner on Magador. Brittany Griner on the step through, and she will draw the Brittany Griner. On the kick out, Brianna Stewart. Her first miss, but feeding Tolo with the shot clock at two. Blocked again by Stewart. And the re steal. Beck Allen out of the corner off. And oh, hey, shoots the three. Now you the Aussies came in averaging 76 points a game. Ended finally. And Sue Bird corner three. Perfect team. Chelsea Gray, baseline fade. The screen. Chelsea Gray fought over that screen. And Mariana Tolo. Trying to drop it back to talk about the experience of Australia. And Leilani Mitchell. It Chelsea Gray, it is fun to watch steal. Magma Gore, good hands, better finish. For them to come back in this one. Sue Bird, good look for three. Sue Bird. Chelsea Gray sensing a seam all the way to the iron to lay it up. Attention. Kayla George dropping into Alana Smith. Nice pass to Asia Wilson. And missing this tournament so far. Feed into Tolo. And Behind the back, there's the fadeaway jumper. And just who builds momentum the final two minutes of this half? The pass into Charles. Brianna Stewart, the early post up, put it up and in it. 15 point lead in the ball, another great pass. But Tina Charles good. Brianna Stewart. Brittany Griner, turning, hooking it in. Lonnie Mitchell, across mid court. Continue to get better as the tournament went on because of that, and and it's true we've seen that. I mean, this is what does Sandy Brondello say at halftime? You're down 21. You're playing this incredible half as well, and, and so that's what you're you're just saying to your group is we're getting good looks, guys. A clock down to five. Leilani Mitchell will have it on the perimeter and drop in the three. To NBA. Leilani Mitchell. Very few athletes in the Olympics at all have five gold medals. Ariel Atkins getting some third quarter playing time again. Brittany Griner tipping in. The Australia comeback, but yeah, that's definitely a top of mind, especially for Bird and Tarana. You got Talbot with the offensive rebound, but denied by Gray. Shot clock at seven. Another incredible pass. Ariel Atkins just off on. Chelsea Gray into Brittany Griner. And, you know, Brittany Chelsea Gray with Tina Charles, Brittany Griner, and Tarazi. And Kayla Jordan. Shot clock at 12, beating Brittany Griner down low. Brittany Griner. Griner on the roll again, and this time she's Herbia. Tina Charles, three. And that one is they, they're able to make adjustments mid game. They're able to correct some of their errors, and they're able to still. Imagine down the lane, and so that ends. Tina Charles and Sylvie did not rule out Paris in three years. Women basketball athletes. Uh, there's no question the Olympic year is long, and, and you're right. International play on top of Team USA, on top of the WNBA, and it misses there. Is there a women's country out the international fervor for basketball and gave us Dirk Nowitzki? And One of the great things that this team does is inspire high school players. The United States kind of decided the outcome by halftime. Just telling you, you didn't make the team in. Oh, baby, you the phone calls come up. <laughs> hey, the phone calls go out. 24 second violation. Jewel Lloyd with the shot clock at one. Put that off back iron. Give me the next time around, I think, could develop into a key part of the rotation for Team USA. So be a, they will have to regroup for the Opals, an incredibly proud side. Lady finding Alana Smith. And just short. Agbagor, that's a nice give and go with here as this one was decided.
by halftime. And Skyler Diggins, Smith. essentially the whole fourth quarter. And the game's come back.